king has arrived. Lee's dad, Bernie, has arrived with some food for the party. Somewhere cold. Somewhere cold. Fantastic. Yeah. We'll see you later, Bernie. See you later. Thank you again. Au revoir. Au revoir. See you later. Au revoir. See you later. Thanks, Ben. Bye bye. Bye. Meanwhile, downstairs is the next stage of Steve's makeover and he's entrusted his daughter Sydney with cutting his hair. I had short hair about two years ago. And I haven't had a haircut for about two years. I've been looking forward to Sydney cutting my hair for ages. She's really good with hair. She does lovely hair ups, don't you, Thank darling? Thank you very much, Dad. <laughs> she does lovely hair ups. I think she's going to be a fantastic hairdresser. And as you can see, she's very confident. Mind my nose with Sorry. that razor, please. Sorry. Yeah, I probably want to be a hairdresser like my dad. I'm going to make you a fantastic hairdresser. And Dad might give me his shop. Of course I will. I'll give you his shop. Buy you loads of shops. You used to look cool with uh, long hair. Yeah. And now you're going to look a bit different. And yeah? Bit of a wally? Yeah. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Bit of a wally. Be a bit choppy choppy. Hack it off from there. Get it off. Just do it. Go on. <laughs> Go on. Come on, cut it off. Sorry. I've got ears. I can feel the coolness of air on my neck. I love it. Well done. <laughs> Here's a card. One last and final stage, shaving the beard off. Do you think? No, once I've got a bit of gear in there, you know, suit, kiss kissing. What do you think? Tastes good? Never liked what in my life. Not, uh, not bad. Actually. Unique, aren't they? Leaders are like them, but I think they're fabulous. Mm, nice. Well, Steve, we've got to get going because um, this, we've only got sort of 40 minutes before the party starts. While the bosses are off getting ready, the salon team do the final party preparations. Laying out the red carpet is causing some confusion. Are these going in? No, I would put a piece there and a piece here. Put this one down. Look at that, though. That, have you measured that? Have you tried to put that that way? Is that too long? This way, and then you have another lake going that way across the front. The carpet is ready just in time for Lee, Carlo and Steve's return. Which bit of that stall, Steve? What? <laughs> the salon has generated a lot of excitement and the turnout of colleagues, family and friends is good as Lee starts to greet his guests. I was proud of him before he came here, so I'm even more now. Of course he's looking absolutely exquisite. Uh, you know, his suit looks very good. I've been called a porn star. Um, <laughs> Dirk Digger in disguise. Mickey Rourke. Oh. A pimp. Oh. oh, the one I didn't like was Donald Sutherland. Well, he's a midnight cowboy, isn't he? <laughs> I want to show you the toilet in a minute. That's my, that's my pride and joy. 
I'm glad everyone's talking about it. I had, to, I had to fight so hard to make that happen. Because we had to knock down walls. Whoa. And... Whoa. Oh, my dreams have come true. Don't come out. <laughs> Hey you. Hey you. Yeah. Are you using that? <laughs> come on, just give us a little song. Give us a little <laughs> no. Yeah, come on, just a little burst. Come on, yes, you can. Excuse me, ladies. This is the. You like the toilet? Yes. Big and a boom. Three. Four. Come on. No. Three. You want toilet? Aye. We're naughty, aren't we? <laughs> We're naughty, aren't we? We're naughty, aren't we? The party feels like a great success and guests continue to arrive late into the evening. How are you, Mush? How are you, sir? Good to see you, bro. Good to see you, bro. Good to see you, Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. Thanks for putting on the list, you Can I put you on the list? No. Beautiful, man. Do you know what I mean? It looks a little bit like my flat, you know? With the chandeliers and that and the, and the toilet and stuff, but it's it's just beautiful, isn't it? I hope the geezer didn't cut air, because if he can't, he's in trouble. This is the main man, the Cantoni family. Yeah, it, it, Salvatore and Carlo Cantoni <laughs> Stallioni, with two stallions in motion. Fabulous. Fabulous. The chandeliers are there. Just, it's another Lee Stafford triumph. It's amazing. All the salons are different, and the, but this is just gorgeous. Chandeliers, big gold mirrors, it's camp on a stick, but it's fabulous. And Lee's gorgeous as ever. So what do you think of the salon, Sal? Excellent. Yeah. yeah. What would you change if you changed anything? Uh, the, the directors. <laughs> 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 How's it going? Mate, just got here, nick of three time. Hours. Three hours, just Three hours, you made it mate, you made it. Good though, right? Oh yeah mate, loving it. Just this way. After a successful but long and emotional evening, Lee reflects on the roller coaster that has been the last two months. I just feel, um, you know, I've got 150 of the people that I love most in the world in that room tonight, do you know what I mean? They've all come from, none of them live in Brighton, or very few of them, they've all travelled many, many miles to be here tonight and support us. And I feel sad now that even though I know that this is a different journey from here on in, it's been such an amazing, exciting journey bringing this to light. And, um, I'm just sad that this part of the journey's over, you know? I'm, I'm aching to do another one now.